Now we're going to go over some features of the router. Uh, the first thing that you'll notice is the active preset drop down menu, which allows you to select the preset that you want to load. After that is the restart button, which basically reloads the current preset. Now we'll drop down to the device configuration area, and that not only tells you how many devices are connected, but allows you to configure the devices. So if one is deck A and two is deck B, you can go in and swap them around. A little bit lower is the activity monitor, which pretty much tells you about the traffic going into the router. And the most important button on this whole interface is the question mark button. Once you click on the question mark, it's going to bring you to a web page that's going to load documentation on the preset. It's going to give you good information about the details of the preset, such as how to install it, um, button layouts, the MIDI notes, and any other questions that you would have about that preset.